Hello, all you lovely people out there. It's called Blaze here, and as you can see, we are back in Amnesia. In the last episode, dealt with the stupid water monster dick. Okay, we dealt with the stupid water monster dick bag, and we got to this beautiful thing, which. Um, I don't know what this is, but no, yeah. Well, we got to the monster, water monster part, and I didn't die, surprisingly. No, wait, I. I did die, that's right. I, I'm trying to remember. I did die once. Yeah, that might be a way to go. That also might be the way to go. I don't know where the way to go. Oh yo ho. I don't know, I'm just I was just trying to rhyme there. To just to try to be a cool gangster, y'all. Oh, uh, what's in here? <gasps> oil, thank Jesus. I love you, oil. Oil's my bud. I guess we'll go into this door that mysteriously opened. Yeah, it does not get scared Would it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. Vertical part? So, you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum at Regent's Park has one. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panorama. Good. This ride might be a little longer. And in the other direction. Down, I'm guessing? Okay. Those are starting to scare me, spook me, um, spook me a little less whenever they happen. I don't want to go in there just yet. Locked. I'm just, before I go in here, I'm gonna check these other rooms. Check the study I can go into. He returned the cup of, the teacup saucer. And picked up the orb as one would nap on, pondered on the strange happenings. I think it's talking about us or the main character. I'm pretty sure we play as that guy. I'm not sure though. I can, don't quote me on that. I'm pretty sure we do. If, I, if I've been paying attention to it. I don't know. A little bit too quiet. It's a little too quiet. Things gonna explode on me again? No? Okay. I thought maybe it won't. One of them was a... One of them was a decoy. This area is really creepy. Well, I can make ch the chairs do sweet flips. Sweet flips, Bree. Don't even know what book that was, but it got. Th and I threw it on the ground. To my most trusted student and friend, John Wayner, the most remarkable thing happened to me as I was traveling. Hap the th most remarkable thing happened as I was traveling through the Prussian. Parisian, Prussian, I don't know, woods this summer. I finally found one of the orbs I have been looking for at least 20 odd years. It is as inexplicable as the Helodromus described in the, in the Hortus Conclusionus. It was, it was as it was told about an underground Mithric temple crowned with the uh, unearthly Artifact. The orb was okay. How long is this going on? Oh my god, I'm not reading this all. Okay, you can pause if you want to read the rest of that. Pause. If, no, pause if you want to read that. Pause if you want to read that. And your friend and mentor, how blah 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 blah. Okay. I came in this room specifically just for a freaking note that I'm not even gonna read because it's too long to read. 
Where is this windy field? This area is quite eerie. Um, okay, um. I don't much like. Let's see what you have to offer. Oh, no, not the popper schnup! Or you just shouldn't have done it all, you just back. It's definitely there. Chambers of the human skull? I don't think I much like this guy. Can I then get this back and then go? Ah, yeah. I knew it. Uh, that's. That's quite sad. Why'd they hurt the pupper snoops like that? Well, hello there. <laughs> can, I, can I break you open? Is there treasure inside of you? I have oil. I'm not gonna use my lan lantern though right now. I need to. Okay, pause if you wanna read. I'm not reading this. Okay, there you go. You can. What is this? You're not gonna describe that? This dude is sick and demented. Makes me. You know, there's Minecraft textures again. Like, not even joking. Look at that. Minecraft textures. Shrieking straight out of Minecraft. Um, ooh, tinderbox. I'm pretty sure that was supposed to happen. Um, is that literally the whole point of this room? Come in. No, I did get a note. Okay, is there anything this way? Nope, it seems to have caved in. Well then. Don't my oh my god, there's freaking stuff going out here. Uh, but I don't much appreciate this game. I almost walked off that damn edge. Take that! I thought. Okay, what is this? When I click it, when will it be my turn? Have I not shown restraint? My patient spans centuries from where I came. Mankind is not even wasted a breath. Yeah, I bow to you. I have done so much for you, and I have gained nothing in return. Agapraga, I trust you. It is I who, in all fairness, should have entered the ga that gate? What gate are you talking about? Like the warp portal to hell? Is that what gate you're talking about? The gate to hell? In an emergency decelerator? Oh, for like mine cards, I'm guessing. Also, take that game. Chamber control. Using steam power for elevation. Elevator schematics. Da da da. Elevator renovation plans. I feel like I was supposed to go here first anyway. Um. The elevator breaks down again. Make sure to use the steam engine to build up pressure before channeling it into the machinery. Just the levers. Um. To the right amount. Instead of the pressure on the machinery, read up, up eight, down eight. Make sure the flow is set according to the Trinity set steam functions. No, Trinity steam set functions. Four phase amplitude. Complete s flow circle. Note that the machine will not check proper configuration until all rods are inserted. Okay. So I'm assuming it's going to be a wild goose chase to find all these rod things. Well. 
so many tinder boxes. Are you gonna explode? Yes, you are. Okay. Well. Because I was gonna come here that this. Well, then. I need to sprint jump like in Minecraft. I don't like that noise. There's freaking demon dogs in this game now. Can I throw that up the wall? No, okay. I just thought because of Resident Evil and all that type of stuff. He climbed out of bed and looked out the window. It was completely dark. He waited and glanced at the old clock and waited some more. Four o'clock, he thought. It's enough. Enough for what? Enough for what? Guest room. The thin cold mist brushed his face as he stepped outside. London weather could be cruel, but it was kind of cruelty he could handle. Okay. Not stupid bug things again. My journal is gone. What would they want with my journal? What would they want with your journal? Probably all the thoughts and stuff from it. Anything in here? Now, Lord, damn, damn, Lord, damn. 2nd of July, 1839. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. I guess you probably should be, huh? Okay, I'll stop. I know many of you appreciate that. <gasps> Earl! Oh my god! Earl! What are you? You're another one of them creepy rabbit things. Nice flip, bro. Whoa, gotta go fast. No. No, okay. As I would assume, there's probably not anything in there. But holy crap, is this our room? As if so, someone just hashtag wrecked it. Crowbar, Morgan, Morgan Freeman. We're, uh, Gordon Freeman now. 3rd of July, 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, We covered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? I have no clue, but what I do know is that it's time to end the video. So, uh, like this video if you liked it. Subscribe to be notified of whenever a video of this or anything else I upload becomes uploaded. Sometimes if YouTube doesn't screw up. And peace off, I love the pizzas out there.